Hi, I'm Dr. Troy Scott, owner of BCS Laboratories and director of Hydro's Chemical Technologies. Today we're going to show you a demonstration of our proprietary oil emulsifying agent, PetroRem, uh, that we hope to be able to implement in the Gulf cleanup efforts. Okay, as you can see, we're using seawater. and We're at the beach right now. We're filling up a tank that has a partition in the middle of it, so we'll be able to separate the treated from the untreated sides. Uh, the partition is actually open at the bottom, and then you'll be able to, to see how the emulsion will spread and actually affect the untreated side eventually. Okay, now we're going to add about 100 milliliters of Pennsylvania crude oil to each side of the tank, and then we'll treat one side, and yet you'll be able to see the product work. Over a little bit of time, we have a pretty uniform slick on the top of the, the water tank here. Okay, now we're going to add petrorem, and uh, we have a solution that is diluted and is going to be effectively diluted again in the tank uh, to uh, about 0.1% of the original concentration, and that's uh, more than enough to, to emulsify the oil here. Okay, now you can see that even without agitation, uh, the product will begin to work. Of course, in, in the sea, uh, we'd have a lot more wave energy, wave action. As with any emulsion, that would speed the process up uh, with, with more agitation. Now we're adding just water here to make, make a little bit more agitation. So this, this is not petroram, this is just water. And we'll see the, the emulsion continue to, to sink. Okay, at this point we're going to agitate the tank to mimic the environment of the ocean. And you can see the emulsion is, is complete at this point. Okay, now we're just going to agitate the other side with some water, and as you can see, some of the petrorem has moved underneath the partition and is going to start affecting this side, but uh, just adding water at this point is not uh, completely emulsifying the oil, but eventually uh, both sides of the container uh, would be completely emulsified. Okay, as you can see, uh, both sides of the tank now, you can see even the, on the right-hand side where it was untreated originally is starting to break up. Okay, now we're going to add some salt water to the tank uh, just to show that as we increase the volume and agitate a little bit more, the product's still effective and, and the emulsion is, continues to be stable. After sitting for about five minutes, you can see that the treated side is, is still stable and, and we have the untreated side with the oil on the top. Okay, so after we disposed of the oil properly, we just rinsed out our, our tank and it still had some residual petrorem in it. And it was interesting because we noticed, uh, it was a noticeable difference on the, the surface of the ocean that where the surface tension of the water has still, with even small, minute quantities of petrorem, uh, it changed the surface properties uh, at, of the sea. And you can see that uh, as the waves start to ripple through where the surfactant is coating the top, uh, they, the wave action actually decreases because the surface tension of, at that part has decreased significantly. So an unexpected uh, result and observation. If you see to the left where, where we originally noticed it uh, and that we had to demonstrate it to ourselves uh, here to see if we could repeat it and uh, indeed this is stretching out almost 100 yards out to sea.
And here's where we just repeated that. As you can see, only a small amount of petroleum are required to, to emulsify oil. We're very confident that this would, product would work for the cleanup efforts in the Gulf. Uh, we we're more than happy to provide you with our, a sample of our non-toxic, uh, entirely safe product uh, so that we can uh, mitigate this disaster.